<clears throat> well, hmm. I have an announcement to make. I just would like to let all of you know that Dean Rio is my new campaign manager for my race for the U.S. Senate. Who's that? You don't know who Dean Rio is? No, I don't know who Dean Rio is. Oh he my serves, god. He's your campaign manager. He is my campaign manager. He is the person that got George W. Bush to the White House. Oh. Twice. Well, we can all thank him for that. I think we should. Well, does he share any resemblance to the current world heavyweight champion, Alberto Del Rio? Folks, I don't know no? who that is. Let me no. ask you this. Okay. Okay. How is the roast? It's delicious, actually. Hey, Craig, as much as it pains me to say it, it's Craig. a great roast. It's, it's great. Sure, Craig. Craig. I, I do have the part that is, hey guys, I, I do have the part that is probably the most undercooked. I think it might be the middle. Can't believe my wife is fucking Bob Eichelberg. Is this you me to put that in the oven for you? I'm good. Do you need it heated up? I'm good. Okay. You know, normally I would say yes, but you know, due to the circumstances and the drama of today, I'm gonna say no. Who the hell is Bob Eichelburn? Burn, burn. One more Bob. Oh, it's you. I mean, not really, but it's pretty much you. I gotta, res I gotta respect the hell out of Bob. Is this grass-fed beef? I don't know what type of beef it is. Does grass-fed beef taste any different? It's certainly better for you, and yes, it does go down the esophagus smoother. It's better for you? Yes. How? Well, because the grass makes the muscles in the animals tender. Please don't say muscles. All I can see are Bob Michael Burr's abs in the sun. It's just oily. I know it's sweat. It looks like oil, though. And I, I can want. see, I'm going to be honest, I can see why Carmen is fucking him. It's bullshit, though. He it's does sound like a catch. I can, we're going to talk about I can that. get Dean Rio to see if he can track down. You get the, he knows the private eye I was telling you about earlier. Mm -hmm. He can. He can. Please. And we also know know a couple of. Um, we'll, we'll just call. Why them. don't you confront this guy? It's often rare that you find someone with a six pack and also hairy. Well, he's not hairy. He waxes. Oh, I right. think he waxes. Did you see that happen? No, but you don't get that hairless without waxing. He doesn't use Nair, I don't think. Do they You're have that alopecia. anymore? You're going to have alopecia. You're going to have alopecia, but he has hair on his head. Folks. Oh. Maybe it's a Folks. Way. Folks. Can we all take a moment here to just agree that when Chelsea and Henry return, we are going to be supportive. We're going to be kind and gentle. And we're going to show him and we want him to get help. Can we all agree on that? I've been doing that all night, but okay, Lynn, yes. You've been doing a fantastic job. Thank you. As best you can. I've been handling my brother quite well. I thought I made it honest. obvious. Let's that not I turn this boxing. into a pissing contest here. Let's just agree to be courteous, to be kind, loving, and to show him that the reason he came here is because we care about him. Though I have never met him, and we want him to get help. I think Agreed? We agree. We can agree, though. No. I said it. We agree. I Frank, if you agree, do you agree? You know what? I actually agree with you here, so. Thank you. Cheers to everybody here. He agrees to get help. Let's, let's help him out. I can have the windowless van from New Beginnings in front of the house oh. in 30 minutes. Jesus, I... My driver would pick him up in 20. Once again, let's not turn this into a pissing contest. He is my brother. I, I would I'd like that. to state... Folks! I'm unfamiliar Folks. with that vernacular. Folks. Folks! He is my twin brother. Folks! I've known him Folks. since before. Folks! Can you not... Do you not understand where I'm going with the folks? 